What's going on everybody? Moose Juice here and today we're going to take a little break from getting non-stop mothership kills and we're going to talk a little bit about this new 10th specialist that has been blowing up. Unfortunately, I'm on the Xbox so I do not have the DLC yet obviously. But if you've seen any of the other videos on YouTube, you know that there's an Easter egg in the new DLC map, Gauntlet. And in this map, there's a building that has all these shrines with all nine specialists. It shows their helmets, their armor, their guns, stuff like that. And it has a little nameplate at the bottom with the specialist name. And then, in this same room, there is one shrine that is completely empty. The name is scratched out down below. Infantry down. But there is a jack of spades in the shrine. Obviously, someone left it there purposely for us to catch. And what a lot of people are linking it back to right now is Death Card 8 of Call of Duty World at War. And what this Death Card did was when activated, enemies could only die via a headshot. And that doesn't really make a lot of sense to me. Because one, obviously that is fighting against you if you can only kill enemies with headshots. And two, we already have a specialist with kinetic armor. And when the kinetic armor is active, you can only get killed by a headshot. But what I am personally hoping for is that this Jack of Spades is like the specialist we saw in Modern Warfare 3. For those that never played Modern Warfare 3, what this specialist was was you didn't select any kill streaks at all or score streaks. All you had you started with your three perks, and then for every two kills you got, you got another perk. Uh, the first three perks were lined up by yourself. So, say you start with your three perks, you get two kills, and then you get ghost. You get four kills, and you get flak jacket, stuff like that. And then once you got, I think it was six or eight kills, you got all the perks in the game until you died. And then you start back from just having your three perks. And that's what I'm really linking this jack of spades or this blackjack card to. What I'm thinking about is Jack of all trades. Uh, and what is a better way to show the Jack of all trades and having all the perks in the game? I mean, you have Ghost, you have Flak Jacket, you have Blind Eye, you have Scavenger, Cold Blooded, Quick Draw, and you're just gonna run around and dominate. So again, I'm really, really hoping this is what <laughs> this Easter egg is for us, because that would be huge. Uh, but again, no one knows 100% sure what it is at this time, or when it will even be released. Uh, what I'm thinking is it should be coming out around the same time Xbox gets its DLC just to kind of make it fair for everybody because uh, it already sucks that PlayStation got the oh, DLC first and we still have to wait a month. But I would assume it's coming out around the same time as Xbox DLC. I'm pretty sure like the other guns, unfortunately, it's going to be pushed to the black market. And if it does, I know there's going to be a huge uproar. I'd love to hear what you guys think, what this 10th specialist is going to be, what this jack of spades means. So make sure you comment below with what you think this is going to be, when it's going to come out, is it even going to be a 10th specialist. Uh, and always make sure you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and uh, thanks for watching.